guys, it's Elise and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be the always requested Ask Elise. These are the simplest videos to make and they're highly requested all the damn time. So, here we are with another one. Um, if you ever want to participate, you just have to wait for my tweet that will say that time again. And then so, without further ado, let's uh, answer some of you guys' questions. Okay, first one comes from Gaffin23 and it says, This isn't really a question, but a mind-blowing fact. Nobody ever said that Humpty Dumpty was an egg. <coughs> Humpty Dumpty sat on a... Oh my god, it doesn't say Humpty Dumpty was an egg. Next one, it comes from Abby and she says, What are you hoping for on the new Little Mix album? I want bops. I want just... I've said this a million times, but an upgrade of Glory Days. Like, Glory Days was like, yes, everything. This is the best album yet. And I just want them to just up that ante a little bit more. And then it's going to get harder every time they do an album. But gradually go, you know, up, a, up the stairs. And, like, every stair is a different album. And they just get better and better, and better until they reach the top. And, oh. Anyway. I have hair in my mouth. That's the end of that question. It's from Hannah. And she says, at a, si a singing, I think this is a signing, do you have to buy the album before or do you get it there? The, the signings I've been to are before the albums actually come out. So they say you pre-order the album and then you get to meet the girls at, at the specific signing that is. Um, yeah, so when I was at the Glory Days road trip in Sydney, they had people there and they had pre-order the album, you get a free t-shirt and the album would come to you in the mail and you would be able to get a photo opportunity with the girls. For the salute one where I met them at a signing, a literal signing, it was pre-order the album, the album would be sent to you, um, and if you're one of the first 500 people then you would get to meet the girls, which I was, and I'm a god and I look ugly in the photo, but whatever. So yeah. This song comes from The Night Jade, and it says, if you could sing any song live with Little Mix, what would it be? Well. It would be really embarrassing to sing their, one of their songs on stage with them because I can't sing as it is, kind of, I don't know. Um, I'd probably sing... Well, my favourite song of all time is Salute, but that's a really hard song to sing. I'm going to say... Wings? Because it's just like the first song, like everyone knows it, so if I sound bad the whole... I can go like... Because like... <laughs> I could not sing on stage a little mix. That is the thing that would never ever happen, ever. But, oh my god. So yeah. I'd say wins. Okay, this one comes from Jodie Martin and it says, What would you define between a mixer and a fan? A mixer will have post notifications on for all the things. So Twitter, all four, Insta five Instagrams really, the little mix one and all their personal ones. You'll follow them on Snapchat. You'll watch their Instagram stories. You will religiously look at everything. You will like nitty gritty bits in between like all those sorts of things and you will stand up for the girls a fan is like oh i really like their music it's really good oh my god black magic's a great song isn't it like oh my god yes love it mixes we will fight for the girls really so that's what i would say which reggaeton lento makeup look was your favorite to do my favorite to do was jesse's because i I think it was just more suited to the way I do my makeup, except it doesn't have liquid liner. But then when Jay, I did Jade's makeup, the way that Adam had done Jade's makeup is something that doesn't suit my face. Because putting, I don't know if you can see, but I don't ever put anything in my waterline because it really does close my eyes up and I look very, very strange. So I always put dark shadow underneath my lower lash line if I want to, you know, darken it up a little bit. So when I was doing jades, I had to put, um, you know, like a pencil black liner in my waterline and it just shut my eye in and I looked very strange at the end, but I had to do what was the look for reggaeton lento. So jade was my least favorite, but it was my style because it had the wing liner. It makes no sense, I know. But Jessie's and Perry's were probably my favorite. Jessie's more though, because they're not exactly the same. But you know, whatever. <laughs> Next one comes from Little Mix Divas. This is favorite outfit from reggaeton lento. Uh, Jessie's, come on, like, <laughs> like, come on. Uh, this one comes from O underscore D M H, and it says your fa your least favorite Little Mix performance. Uh, my least favorite? Oh, that's a hard one. I'm gonna say I Heart Radio. The hell was that? 
Um, I know you guys wanted a reaction to that, but I was seeing so much drama, I was like, what the hell? And I kind of just was on Twitter and it kind of was all just happening, so I couldn't react for you guys. Um, if you want me to react to a specific video, then let me know, but know that I have seen it, so... Next one comes from Luke Mordu and he says, What is your predictions for the next Sia album? What are you hoping for? The next, well, Sia never puts out a bad album. Um, so if you guys don't know from Little Mix, it goes to Sia. Sia is my next favourite artist. Um, for the next Sia album, I just want it to be everything. Because whatever Sia does, I'll love. Like, there's nothing that Sia do like won't do that I won't love. Like, she has a song with Zayn. Love it. She has a song with Pink. I love it. Like, I'm not the biggest fan of Pink, and I'm the biggest fan of Zayn, but she is in it, and I love it. How many waterfall, you know? Like, I love it. So, yeah, whatever Sia does, I love. So, whatever Sia has planned in her marvellous brain, I'm down for it. Christine Lovato says, name 10 drag queens ready and go, okay? Willem, Alaska, Courtney, Detox, Bianca Del Rio, um, Violet Chachki, La, 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 la. How many is that? Six. Um, 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 what the fuck? What the fuck? Roxy Andrews. Um, Ginger Minge. Um, 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 uh, Alyssa Edwards. Um, um, Fifi O'Hara. She is the worst queen. I don't like her at all. T. Okay. <laughs> Next one comes from Ayana Nelson Mix and it says, How are you slaying every single Instagram post? Please explain the process you go through to take them. Well, we are in the right spot, aren't we? I literally just took some before this video. So, what I do is I set my camera up that I film on, on the tripod, and I aim it at my... This is my purple wall. This is all four of my walls in my room are this colour. And this is the only part in the room that doesn't have a bed, or a shelf, or a nail polish rack, or perfumes, or whatever. So, this is where I stand. It is next to a bookshelf and my bed. And I just wedge myself in here, and I kind of just fluff my hair out and then I turn on the camera and, it, and it's on a little self timer I just you know angle my hair and I just pose well this is the one I've been doing lately I go like this and I flick my hair like that and I just pose like that it's really simple really easy um, and then I just go on to my laptop send it to myself post it on Instagram like it's really not that hard like yeah but I have to you know look good like I won't just take a photo if I have not done hair like you'll never see on Instagram a photo of my hair not done <laughs> um but, well, if I'm taking a photo like this sometimes there'll be like one me a bun but yeah last one says sing a little bit of reggaeton lento so I don't see why not so I'm going to is there a I'm gonna see if there's an instrumental on here and I'll just sing the chorus. It started when I looked in her eyes, I got close and I'm like, bailemos, eh, yo no just a paro de gueto lento, no se hace baile más el tempo. And we go so maybe get let me de bailemos, eh, and now we dance in all reggaeto lento, get a little closer baby let go, ooh. And I guess with that, that is the end of this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a giant thumbs up. Take this time to follow me on all my social medias, Twitter, both my Instagram, Snapchat, all the things. Subscribe if you're new to this channel. I make videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.